Hey everyone and welcome to Robbie's Backstage Bands. This is a very different video. Um, the second one of the sort I've done, but this is very, very different because this is the very last video of 2020, maybe even uploaded on the very first day of 2021, but I don't know yet. So Merry Christmas. I hope you had a great Christmas. It's not, it, it, it's Christmas Eve at the current moment in time on this particular day. Uh, it's going to be filmed over quite a few days, so you're going to see me dotting around everywhere. Uh, but it is Christmas Eve. So Merry Christmas, everyone. I hope you had a fantastic Christmas and got everything you wanted. Um, I hope I did too. <laughs> we'll soon find out. Um, <clears throat> uh, also, a Happy New Year. Finally out of 2020. Uh, obviously, I'm quite thankful, of course, for, 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 for the page in 2020. But everything else in 2020, it can go. We can get rid of that. That's done. But uh, I thought I'd do a little roundup of the year episode. I've invited some of my past guests back, which you will see later in the episode. I have got some clips to re some clips to react to from um, from episodes uh, I have had compiled for me. Uh, lots of best moments, and we're just gonna review review backstage bands twenty twenty, I guess, and go through everything and see the different things that have happened and talk about some things that have been done. And we're just going to go through what has happened from September to now and some shout outs, some thank yous, just everything. So let's, let's get on a roll with it. <laughs> As the people who've been with me from the beginning know, I started the page at the very beginning of September this year, 2020 is now. Um, which was uh, really exciting for me. I was really excited to start the page and I had already filmed my interviews with Amy and Hazel. Now, the first thing we're gonna do today is I'm gonna, my first ever interview I ever did was Amy Ellen Richardson. So we're gonna give a little short snippet of this a watch. Uh, I've just found my favorite part, uh, which I found quite funny. And this is from 20 minutes into the video. Let's have a little look. I've been lucky to do Into the Woods twice. So I did uh, I did the wonderful Regents Park production with a stellar cast of people. I mean, it was insane. Yeah. Even at the time, you know, because it was, I think it was 2011, I think, at the time. Um, and, and then a few years later, I got to play the baker's wife. So I was Florinda in the Regent's Park production, which was a scream. And, and then I got to play uh, the baker's wife, which were massive shoes to fill, but I absolutely mm -hmm. adored every second of it. And I remember thinking to myself, if my career ends now, I'll be happy. <laughs> playing <laughs> oh, the baker's no. wife. Absolutely not. And her career didn't end, as you've probably seen. Um, Amy was in the Grinch musical that just aired on the telly on the telly. So uh, you should definitely, if you didn't get a chance to watch that, you should go find it because the Grinch musical is beautiful. It was so much fun and it was really great seeing Amy, quite a big, big role in that show. So the next thing that happened after Amy's interview was of course, Hazel's interview. Now, before I react to anything from Hazel's interview or talk about anything from Hazel's interview, I have a little, uh, a little clip to show you right now. So my first guest of the episode is Hazel. Hazel's back, everyone. How have you been? Good. Yeah. It's All been right. a while. It's been a while. It has. September was the last time. And what's happened since then? A concert that, that may have had you in it. There was that. There was a Halloween concert. This is true. Yeah. There's just so many concerts that, that just as you keep appearing, you, you've never left. It's That's my job. It's we, just... say, we say it's been a while. She's really just been here all along. Everything you see is all actually Hazel. It's just, it's not... just me hovering beneath the surface. Not me. <laughs> it's, 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 it's all just puppeteered by Hazel. So I've got something by my side here to show you. Hey! <laughs> it's the physical thing in oh real life. Oh my God, it looks so good. I'm touching it right now. Oh, it's mad. Honestly, it looks really good. It is so good. Thanks to Ella for those. They are incredible. I need to go and buy one so I can like put it in my box of, you know, things that I did. Yeah. In 2020. You did in 2020. 
I, I love that. That that concert was was really really amazing too. It, that was fun. I think everyone really enjoyed the concert. It was a load. It was a load of bands. P- yeah. True, truly. <laughs> it, was, it was. And then you got you got you got nice and spooky for the Halloween concert too. That was fun. Yeah, we do like an opportunity to be spooky. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we all? And even Christmas, you came on Advent too. You, you, you I did. Haven't gone. Oh my god, that was so much fun. Was I fun. forgot about that. <laughs> I, I remember receiving that recording, be like, oh, she did that. <laughs> and I hadn't had any coffee. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> we we don't know. So, what are you planning on doing for for Christmas then? What what's the, what's the plan? Good question. Um, well, <laughs> basically nothing. So, I'm quite I'm one of the lucky ones that tier four tier four hasn't affected because we weren't meeting up with anybody in particular outside of our bubble. That's really good. Um, so just we're just going to carry on as normal, so apart good. from. Heading to the shops yesterday. I have been lumbered with both grocery shops for Christmas. Oh, no. And we went to Morrison's yesterday. And as I came out, the queue was round the building to get in. Are you mad? Ah. That's a no from me. That's not good. I'm so glad. Get in I'm early. Tier four. I mean, not to brag or anything, but I can actually go outside. <laughs> so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> I've got my government sanctioned walk and a trip to the shops. And that's it. Wow. I'm really glad that's not me right now. But, <laughs> that's really 2020. <laughs> but we'll be out of it. We'll be out of it. And I'm sure you'll make a return at some point in 2021, knowing you. You'll, you'll, be, you'll be back on here with, in no time. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you'll be like, by the way, uh, I want to do this now. Okay, fine. Let's, let's just. <laughs> yeah. There's always something. And I'll just be like, here's all. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to do it? And I'll be like, why not? <laughs> I'm coming in. Yeah. Of that it's so good to have you back on though like it's so good being face to face obviously not face to face Boris please don't as much as we can <laughs> yeah yeah face to zoom to face and it's been when did we do the the interview it was it that was in like, like August it or... was it could have well been the end of August I think yeah so that really we, was like we oh, filmed them, a long time ago we filmed them early didn't we because yeah and then I, that, wow that was a long time ago yeah and all ever since has just been do this song for me thanks <laughs> i've got this coming up uh do you want to do it <laughs> you, want, you want to do that yeah it, it has been 2020 has been a mad one yeah mad for you as well because you spent now the later half of 2020 building yeah. a new instagram page that's new me. brand that's me yeah just... not being busy at all then I, f- I feel like um writing a little uh a song about how <laughs> you should i might who knows what this episode entails because i mean i haven't filmed the whole episode yet so maybe by the end of it there might... <laughs> it might, be... In for... might be a little tune yeah just just yes yeah. play it on the christmas but... tree yeah you it... could always pick up a new instrument play a little yeah in all the free time that i've got <laughs> yeah you know what i mean no you don't do it in your free time you do it when you're procrastinating doing something else this is true. That's the best time to learn. How did you know? <laughs> That's what I spent the last two months doing. I've been learning the Krusty Krab theme <laughs> on the recorder. I can't play the recorder. Well, can you play the Krusty Krab theme? I've been learning it. Do you want to hear it? Please. It's bad. Okay, you have been warned. I don't know how close this is going to be to the microphone. Uh, you had that. You had that way. You, you, you wanted to do this. Low key, a little bit, a little bit, but you see, I've been playing this like s- very, very slowly to my friends and driving my whole family crazy. <laughs> um, and obviously, I've not been on Instagram, so nobody's seen this. Well, here <laughs> we it is world premiere. Here we go. World premiere. It's not very good. I either mess up the beginning or the end. I can never seem to get it right. Is the middle all right? No. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. <laughs> fix it I'm gonna sweat now it's not gonna be very good that's actually kind of quite good I've that not was done really it that good well zoom made it very quiet but I could still hear it it was oh was it really quiet it was zoom just went 
but I could hear it. It was good. Zoom went, no. Zoom went, are you sure you want to hear this? <laughs> yeah, right. Zoom was like, oh, that's high pitched. We don't need that. <laughs> None of that. Dog's ears only, yeah. that one. <laughs> but apart from that, I think that's everything that's happened in the small section of 2020 that I've, I've existed. <laughs> yeah, guys, just in case you didn't know, I only started existing at the beginning of uh, the very end of August, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, I just, that's the point you finally just appeared in the ether and you were like, oh, just rocked what, up on what, the planet and was like, uh, hello? <laughs> what a Mars. very strange world I find myself in. <laughs> Pandemic? What's that? Yeah, that was me rocking up here <laughs> in the end of August. <laughs> Thank you so much for, for joining me on my very last 2020 finale. Thank you for having me. <laughs> very first person I've had on, so who knows what else is going to happen. This is the first thing I've filmed. I mean, that just messes up everyone's brains with the chronology of the video, but this is just this is the first thing that's happened for the for the episode. So who knows what it entails, but hopefully it's good. Yeah. I need Probably to get a new light. Hopefully I'll get a new light for Christmas because I currently look a bit like a ghost. You're a bit a little bit whited out. No, I'll join you. I'll join you. Let me turn on mine. <laughs> there we go. Hey, Very nice. Ghost team. There we go. <laughs> so hopefully Santa's gonna bring me a light. That'd be good. <laughs> Great. Thanks, Santa. But apart from that, thank you so much. And I will absolutely speak to you in the new year. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers to the end of 2020. Yes. Merry Christmas to everyone. Halloween glass. Hang on. Wee. Yeah, that's good. That'll do. <laughs> that was that. That that was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed recording that little clip with Hazel. So thank you so much for coming back in, Hazel. It was an absolute pleasure speaking to you again especially after all you've done on the page. Of course, you've done the concert too. Your your solo concert, Hazel's solo concert, which was an absolute blast. That was the first ever concert that was ever produced on this account. Um, and I'm really, really pleased that that was, that was a thing. Um, Hazel put so much effort into it. Um, if you go onto her YouTube, you can find a clip of Blackbird um, that Hazel sang, um, and it's really, 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 really good. So if you want, I will link that in the description. You can go and check that one out. Um, so now I've got my favourite little um, snippet from uh, my little interview with Hazel. Um, us talking about Lauren Drew. So this is 23 minutes and 25 seconds into the video if you want to go and see it yourself. But here's me reacting to it. Now you've got, like, you have to remember, this was filmed at the end of August for me, so I can't really remember what's going on in these interviews. <laughs> so here is, here is this clip. Here we go. Because that cast. <laughs> can, can we because... take a moment to, like, silently respect Lauren Drew? <laughs> yes. Yes, and we can. No way, like... Beautiful This stuff. still needs to be, yeah. The queen. An actual queen. We're literally there. You go. When when's she getting her coronation? I, I confused. She needs a knighthood for that. <laughs> <laughs> Get Lauren Drew a knighthood. Um, and I just think that'd oh, be great to see you. At we we do right. Okay, um, Lauren, hey, if you're watching this, hit me up because we'll we'll get you in for a knighthood if you want. Yeah, yeah. Sounds good. Hang up. Sounds great. Okay, perfect. But yeah, of course, I 100% have loved every single interview that I've done. And, and I'm sure, like, you know, everyone has enjoyed watching them. Also, peep the hoodie. Um, but here are some best bits from other interviews um, that my granddad went through and picked out. They're not, it's not from all of them, but he's went through and picked out uh, some moments that made him giggle. Uh, so I'm going to react to the rest of them now because, um, you know, Christmas has been... We've got the new merch. Um, look at this, hang on. <clears throat> Mug. We've got lights, so we're living the dream. Um, <clears throat> also, while I'm here, I'd like to thank Dan for this. This coaster, which you might have seen on the Instagram. I think that's absolutely incredible. I mean, wow. Um, also, there's a t-shirt here, but if anyone is interested, hit me up. Uh, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to see what timestamps have been sent. I haven't watched these clips prior to um, to reacting to them. So it's just going to be... Uh, hang on, I'm just getting up the list. It's just going to be totally random. I mean, let's find out. So the first clip is from um, 
Martin Callahan's interview. There's a few from Martin's interview because that was a giggle altogether. So let's um let's have a little look through. Um, let's go. Oh, it's been hard. It's been. I didn't because to be honest, I didn't think it really affected me. If I'm honest, I was like, eh, fine. When it reopens, eh, it reopens, and I thought, yeah, it didn't really affect me. And then I, and then I watched Coco on um, uh, the the celebration of the music of yeah. Coco on Disney Plus, and there was a guy on stage singing, and I went, <laughs> and that was it. That's when I realised. Yeah, I'm not taking it that well. I'm not. <laughs> I relate to that so much. It's at anything, you know. The show must go on streams that have been going on through, through, throughout. Man, seeing people performing is just a wow. Which is why I am so thankful for the takeovers as well. Lucy and Natalie. The posters hopefully popped up around. Thank you so much for doing them because they were so good to see. Theatre still going on. It was so incredible. So my next clip again is one from Martin Callahan. I need to get the um the time the time slot just about right. Um It was matte painting. So if you look at the bit where they show you the um uh the pharaoh head, but then you can see like a night sky and a moon. Yeah. They shot that through a plate glass. So it's this camera behind a glass that had been painted and then it it, it sort of yeah, it was beautiful. So things like that used to happen. There's loads of map paintings in Star Wars. Wow. But so cool. Yeah, it was beautiful. So it was. It was amazing. And that wasn't the I only don't... thing it was painted, was it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for reminding me. Sorry. No, unfortunately, I had to be painted. I had to be painted grey. <laughs> <laughs> because I am possibly the palest biblical Jew ever. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, you know, ginger. I wasn't grey then, and I didn't have a beard. Uh, but, yeah, I mean, just, just, I was so pale. I was so, so pale. They said, uh, unfortunately, we're going to have to paint you grey <laughs> beforehand, and then put tan on you. And I was like, oh, okay. Oh, that's what, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, so got... That is beautiful. Martin, Whenever you want painting grey, feel free to post it again on social media. Uh, but if anyone wants to see Martin grey, go watch the Joseph film. <laughs> and this is the last clip from Martin's. Um, I feel like I used this clip for promo, I think, if that if this is what I think it is. Um, so let's uh, roll the clip. <laughs> it's, like, it's like somebody wants to ask me, are you going to go up for Superstar? You know, so you remember that? program where they were finding a Jesus yeah. and it was called cool. they asked me if I was going to go up for that for Jesus me it's like go on really no they need a reinforced cross <laughs> do you know what I mean no of course they didn't have a metal there. one in the arena tour they got a big metal cross you might have well I, yeah but I'd still have bent that <laughs> Sorry. just suddenly they're going <laughs> Like a 3D experience, no. Yeah, uh, coming at ya! <laughs> but no. But, <laughs> no. <laughs> that is my favourite clip of all time. That clip. If anyone wants to just remind me constantly that that clip exists. <laughs> Love it. Alright, let's 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 see what's next. Okay, so my next clip <clears throat> is from Shaka's interview. Now, as you know, Shaka did Glow and Celebrate. Bing, which was uh, a gorgeous little concert that we put together. Um, Shaka did about 100% of the work, uh, but it was so good that I could manage to host that and, you know, make it come to life. I was so pleased that Shaka trusted me with that. Um, and also bringing the, uh, the Zoom, the Zoom meet afterwards uh, for a little birthday party, which was really nice, which I really, really enjoyed doing. So thank you, Shaka. Um, and... Here's a clip from the interview. Uh, I believe this is in the fans question section. Let's give it a watch. I think my biggest one was my, my absolute drop. Uh, I'm gonna call it the absolute drop. Yeah, mm -hmm. absolute yeah. drop. Babes, I will never forget it. And I will laugh about it until my last days. I, I just remember going, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. <laughs> and then just falling down the stairs. Trying to still belt down the microphone and still trying to look somewhat oh. decent. All the girls are dancing, facing the audience. I'm oh. like, 
cool. I'm on the floor like, get your ass up off the floor. <laughs> I was talking with Cassie about this. We had Cassie <laughs> on, and she was telling me all she saw was a fan kick from you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was literally it. Like, all it was is my foot went, Whoom, and I was like, stand up. And I was like, because I'm the queen of the girls. So she really got I that. wanted to burst out laughing so bad. Because <laughs> by this point, the girls were looking at me, and I, Bernie was like, are you okay? And I was just like, I would so love to have seen that. Oh, if anyone did see that, please do let me know. But wow, what what? Speechless. These are the stories because I never watched back the interviews. I mean, I watched them back once when I edit them, and from then, and I've done what eighteen now? Is that eighteen? Eighteen. Um. So I think <laughs> it's these things just sort of get get pushed to the back of my mind and then watching them back watching my face is terrifying so I'm just sort of focusing on the other side where Shaka is but it, it springs back and it's so good to just reminisce so thank you granddad for bringing these moments thank you the next clips are from my interview with the lovely Jasmine Beale now before I do react to any of these clips I've got a little clip to insert and uh, here it is Right, so my next guest is Jasmine. Jasmine's back, everyone. Hello. How have you been? <laughs> Did you enjoy Christmas? I've been good. Look, I'm like, how was your like Christmas? happening right now. <laughs> You're literally huh? out in the cold. How was your Christmas? Oh, it was lovely. It was, was it? it was quiet. I was supposed to go back home to family in Oxford, but because no. of tier four. I didn't, no so. way. But I've had a lovely one with my housemates, so it's been... Oh been a nice quiet one that's such a shame you can yeah how was yours you know it was so good because because we're, we're, we're just in tier three so it was all good i, I yeah. was you know, able to leave the house but i feel for you guys that couldn't because i know it's awful, awful. yeah i bet I feel so like what's it... happened since we last um had a little chat there was a, there was a certain christmas concert that uh, just sort of happened and and we sang a little duet too which i think yeah. I, might insert, I might insert the clip into this video <laughs> just go just, just, do it <laughs> just to get it out there i think that'd be that'd be quite quite a nice thing and now i'm branded look at this oh my god we've, sorry we've i'm just hook. getting really close to my camera here <laughs> Hi. <laughs> he's got the merch oi, oi, and i've got oi. lights i've got lights i'm not a ghost anymore Oh my goodness! This is amazing. Santa, Santa really decked me out, didn't he? He was like, "Right, okay, we need we need lights." He done good. He done yeah. good. Oh my goodness! Yeah, real good. That's so cool. I like, know. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that that Christmas concert was so lovely, and it wasn't it. Everyone though? on it was just so unbelievably talented. Yeah, I'm so thankful for that. You bunch of talented people just sort of. <laughs> jumping in there in that Christmas yeah, concert. I think, the thing I think is with Christmas, so nice everyone's so busy. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Everyone's so busy at Christmas. But like you guys still found chance to record, which was good. Because yeah, not not many yeah. people were free. <clears throat> we had like dropping out left, right, yeah, and center. Yeah, I mean oh gosh. But you know what? I feel like it's what everyone needed. And I I yeah. really wanted to do it as well because it was a chance to do something creative. So thank you so much for asking me to do it because it's really oh, no really made my Christmas a lot brighter. Oh, I mean, yeah. it was so much fun to put together as well. Like, I can't, I love Christmas. Christmas is my favourite. So <clears throat> I was so, like, pleased to sort of yeah. listen to a few different Christmas songs while I put it together. It was really nice, actually. It, it was It was definitely oh. something for Christmas. Well, oh. talking about that. Hello, can you hear right. me now? Oh. I can. Whoa. <laughs> Sorry, I am literally in a corridor right now. There we go. Yeah. That was that was um <laughs> scary. There's a ghost. There's a ghost. It wasn't me though, because I've got lights now. Oh. This was a thing. I mean, I'm I'm trying to record this massive video over over a few days. Um so I'm trying to speak to different people who've been on and and the last bit that I recorded, I was pale as anything because I've got no lights, but now yeah. I've got flesh. I, I you can see me. He's got lights. I'm not blending <laughs> with a wall. 
which is always good. But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you get somewhere else because I mean this video is gonna be long. So I'll let you disappear. But thank oh, you for coming in and no, having a little chat you. and catching up. Yes, all the best. Sending lots definitely. of love. Yeah, happy thank you so new much. Year. Yeah, happy new year. We'll definitely <laughs> we'll definitely end up doing something in 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 twenty twenty one. So I'm sure you'll Oh absolutely. Absolutely yeah. hit me up. I'll be there. <laughs> I will. <laughs> thank you so much. I will see you whenever. Whenever <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bye. It was so lovely speaking with Jasmine again, and um, I will play you the clip. I will insert the clip of Baby It's Cold Outside for you all to watch. But first, I've got some clips to react to here. So the first one is apparently not funny, but it's really sweet. So let's have a look. So hungry. And like picking, just about to pick up a slice of my stage manager coming, my company manager coming in, being like, hey, so um, just stand by. Uh, we think that you're going to be going on for Sari tonight um, as Christmas Eve. I just remember putting that, down, putting that pizza down and being like, okay, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> like <clears throat> all these butterflies just filled my tummy and I was like, okay. right, time to look at the script one more time. <laughs> Yeah. Were you just ready for that moment? You were like, I know this back to front, upside down. Yeah. I'm oh my just god, ready. yeah. Yeah, literally. I was so ready. And initially, like, our wardrobe, um, lovely Kelly, she came in with the Christmas Eve costumes and her wedding dress Aww. and all of that. And I was just on the edge of tears, like, I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> <laughs> that is so cute. That is, that is, that moment, that is a story I personally don't think Jasmine will ever forget, um, like going on for Christmas Eve in Avenue Q. There is a picture of that somewhere. Jasmine is Christmas Eve. Um, I'm just making more work for myself for the editing, aren't I? It's just, it, I just, okay. But the next clip is uh, a bit further in. So I don't know if you saw the Britain's Got Talent. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, Daisy Stroud coming down. With her umbrella, that made me cry. Right. Her love made me bore yeah. my eyes out. It, the, it was the empty theatres that they showed, and then come uh, and I was like, stop, I know. stop already. Here, Jackers. You're just making me emotional. <laughs> honestly. But no, I think we need to get another Mary Poppins tour going on. And we need you as Mary Poppins. And we need... We need <laughs> who, who else can we drag into this? <laughs> Ooh, I feel like Robbie. Um, not you, Robbie, not but I mean, okay. you, Robbie, as well, if you I'll, want. I'll, I'll, <laughs> I'll take it. Um, yeah, why not? Let's go. But Robbie Noonan as um, Bert, I, I think he'd be a great Bert. Yeah, I can see that. I think he'd be a great Bert. Let's make it happen. Yeah. Or at least. No, then. Let's do this. <laughs> All right. So now I hope you enjoy this clip of me and Jasmine singing Baby It's Cold Outside from a very stagey Christmas concert. Enjoy. <laughs> Baby, it's cold outside. I gotta go away. But baby, it's cold outside. This evening has been, been hoping that you drop so in. Very nice. I'll hold your hands there just like I start to work. Beautiful, what's your heart? My father will be pacing the floor. Listen to that fireplace. So roar. really I'd better scream. Beautiful. Please don't well, hurry. maybe just a half a drink I'll more. put some records on while I pour. The neighbors might think. Baby, it's bad out there. Say, what's in this drink? No cabs to be had out there. I wish I knew how. Your eyes are like starlight to now. Break the spell. I'll take your hat. Your hair looks swell. I ought to say no, no, no. Mind no, if I move? What's the sense of hurting my pride? I really can't stay. Baby, don't hold out. Baby, Baby it's, it's cold outside. outside. I simply must go. Baby, it's cold 
outside. The answer is no. But baby, it's cold outside. The welcome has been How lucky that you dropped so in. nice and warm. Look out the window at that storm. My sister will be suspicious. Gosh, your lips look delicious. My brother will be there at the door. Waves upon a tropical shore. My maiden aunt's mind is Gosh, your lips are delicious. Maybe just a cigarette more. Never such a blizzard before. I've got to get home. Baby, you'll freeze out there. Say, lend me your coat. It's up to your knees out there. You really been grand. I thrill when you touch but my hand. Don't you see? How can you do this thing to me? There's bound to be talk tomorrow. Think of my lifelong soul. At least there will be you got pneumonia and died. I really can't stay. Open that hold out. Baby, it's, it's cold. cold. Baby, it's, it's cold, cold outside. outside. So my next clip to react to is from Joe Montague's interview. That rhymes slightly. Um... And this is answering a question. I believe it's my granddad's question. So let's find out what he says. Trevor, oh, what do you do yeah. when you forget your lines on stage? Laugh. Laugh. <laughs> Laugh or stare at another actor. Sounds do you nice. look at them as either go help me or just... Like, I, li listen, I have done so many stupid things on stage because <laughs> I am a glorified idiot. So me too. I, I I do get the giggles. I can't help it. And you know, people say it's, people say it's really professional. I'm like, listen, we know it's unprofessional, but when you can't stop laughing and you know you shouldn't be laughing, you keep laughing. <laughs> it's That's not what wrong. Every human does in the world. So I embrace it. I embrace it if I'm a buffoon. I apologise to the right people if I do. And then I move on with my life because I don't think there's any point in dwelling on little scenarios that are not going to kill people. And, and the audience it. love it. The, the audience, audience love it. When you mess up, the audience they love do. it. We love it. Yeah, no, it, it's 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 amusing. I mean, we had one a little story in Nine to Five where she messed up. Uh, I think it was um, it was on tour at Sunderland. It was Laura Tyra as Violet and she couldn't get her words out and then Sean Needham who was on for Franklin Hart uh, who used to play Franklin Hart anyway, um started taking the make out of her and so <laughs> that was um that was really amusing I love things like that now those were the clips that I had sent to me but I do remember so many, so many funny moments from all the interviews. Um, I mean, every single one has been absolutely incredible. I've enjoyed chatting with everybody. You know, we've had Broadway stars on. We've had Kerry Ellis. We've had Glenn Carter, the Jesus. Um, so, you know, and I feel like I'm going for some sort of bliss bingo because I've had Nat, I've had Bryony and I've had Hazel. So... I guess we're sort of trying to trying to get everyone in from that cast, but I've absolutely loved speaking to every single one of them. So let's just do quick thank yous. Um, thank you, Amy. Thank you, Hazel. Thank you, Jacob. Thank you, Cassie. Thank you, Courtney. Thank you, Martin. Thank you, Mallory. Thank you, Joel. Thank you, Shaka. Thank you, Jasmine. Thank you, Rosa. Thank you, Kerry. Thank you, Glenn. Thank you, Bryony. Thank you, Chloe. Thank you, Natalie. Thank you, Christina, and thank you, Rob King. Thank you, everybody. It was just thank you for everyone and everyone who's done the concerts. Now, speaking of the concerts, um, just a little plug the promo. Uh, I have some posters which are created. I did the designs, but the lovely Ella from the Lyrical Roundabout has been printing them for us. So if you want to purchase any of the posters, we have... The Stagey Spooks one, which is looking gorgeous under my new lights. Absolutely. There you've got all the names on there. And I will challenge you to try and get this signed by as many of them as you can. That's the new challenge. If you do, I will buy you something. This is not definitely confirmed. I will, I will send you a letter 
of something. I don't know. We'll do we'll do something. It'll be a challenge. First one to try and get this signed by as many people as possible. Um I mean some of them are gonna be quite easy once the theatres are back open. But you'll have to hunt me down. Uh but yeah, this is the Stigy Spooks one. You should totally check that out. Um uh, if you uh, attended Hazel's concert you may have seen this earlier in the video, but I thought I would show it off again. Uh-huh. And there is a Glow and Celebrate one. Now you can get these in A4. This is A4 or A3. A4 is $5.99 and A3 is $7.99, I really want to say. But for more information on those, you can check out my video that I did um, on my channel. Um just before Christina's interview. So if you wanna check that out, you can go and have a look. And now you can also order the Stady Christmas concert posters too. So there's four to get, catch them all guys, catch them all. But thank you for helping with those Ella. Now, apart from all the reactions to all of the clips and thanking everyone from the interviews, there is not much left to say, except from a massive thank you to everybody who's helped me start my page up this year. I mean, obviously all the stars that have been on for interviews, everyone who's done concerts, but also all you guys who support me all the time and, you know, liking and sharing and following and subscribing. It really does mean the world to me. I mean, I'm just a little 15 year old from the Northern region, but, um, and look at what we've created. I mean, 18, amazing people who I would never have dreamed of being able to be on calls with, you know, Glenn and, and Kerry. And I mean, I remember watching Rob King on the telly and then having him in my, you know, it's just, it's just mad. Mallory and Courtney Broadway, you know, I've gone across the sea. I was thinking about all the places I've been via Zoom. I mean, the amount of houses I've been in, which I shouldn't, have, but you know, um, you know, we've even been in Glenn Carter's boat, you know, out of all places, Courtney Mack's car. You know, it's it's really just fascinating that I've managed to de get this off the ground and it does really mean the world to me that you guys keep supporting and keep going with it because it, it does does really make me smile. So 2021, guys, what we're going to do, we're going to have hopefully some more concerts. Hopefully we'll have some actual theatre sort of vlogs situations um, and maybe some real interviews with real people in a real place where we don't have to worry about being infected that might be nice um but we're beginning the year obviously back on zoom so without further ado i'm just gonna i'm gonna disappear because i think i've said enough i've i've gone on for quite some time i've reacted we've done things so i think that's that's quite what we needed um so thanks for watching uh don't forget to like don't forget to comment. Don't forget to subscribe. We need to bump up the subscribers. Um, and then go, the links are in the description to follow the social medias. Um, make sure you're following. Make sure you've got post notifications turned on. And every now and then, just do a little share to your story. It really does help out. Um, I mean, the more followers we get, the bigger we can grow. And we can get more things done. And I can get things for you guys. Uh, if you ever have any suggestions, please do hit me up. I'm always answering DMs, so if anyone does want to chat, I'll be there. Because I'm never off this little mobile right here. Um, apart from when I'm on a Zoom call. So, you know, it's one or the other. Uh, but apart from that, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next year, everybody. Have a good one. Thank you so much for all the support.